Aeron pilots, this is a very exciting time for this hobby. I have in front of me here one of the first actually flying and well performing V-22 Ospreys with vertical takeoff VTOL capabilities. In this video we're going to just show you the flight character and the flight capabilities of this really fun flying small park flyer size V-22 Osprey. Let's talk a little bit about how this airplane works. I know there's a lot of questions out there. How does this fly? What is it doing? How should I set it up? This is one of the easiest airplanes that you're going to ever get that's going to be as far as in the setup category is concerned. This essentially is five channels. Your four channels will be your throttle, elevator, ailerons, and then your rudder. And your fifth channel in uh, any other aircraft will be your flaps or your retractable gear. And this V22 here, your fifth channel will be your gear switch or your auxiliary switch and uh, on a toggle switch. And what it's going to do is going to control your engine pod angle for transitioning from vertical takeoff to forward flight. Right now we are in the vertical uh, format and I want to show you really quickly here. In the vo vertical format we still have ailerons and then our elevator is actually going to pitch the motor pods and then our rudder, our yacht, is going to actually variate the motor pods so you can actually rotate. So in this essence here, it is flying basically like a multi-rotor or your uh, helicopter format. And then once we transition into forward flight, when, when you hit the transitioning switch, the elevator would actually give you a little bit of up elevator to help uh, keep the nose up during the transitional period. And then once it's in uh, forward flight mode, you have full control. I'll just show you this way here. You have full control over elevator, and then you have ailerons. And how this whole entire system works is it's basically flying off of a uh, flight control board, something similar to the multi-rotors, the quadcopters on the market. Uh, right now we have a 50 millimeter fan in the back that's going to be controlling your hover sta stability for uh, the vertical takeoff mode. So let's go ahead and go back into vertical. When it's, it's in the vertical position here, your fan will actually engage and then you would be able to hover just like a helicopter or a multi-rotor. And in this format here, it's basically your three axis gyro stabilization. It is controlling all of your axes here, all of your axes, including your ailerons, the motor pod positioning, and your elevator, and the fan itself to keep it in a hover. So that's the basic breakdown of this, and uh, right now it's a little bit windy, but let's go have some fun with the V22 Osprey. This is available at bananahobby.com, and uh, it's just a super fun airplane. Let's go have some fun. Let's go ahead and fire up this uh, V-22 Osprey here. This does fly on your four cell system, your four cell lithium polymer battery within the size range of uh, 2200 milliamp and above. Um, I probably wouldn't go as high as 3500 or 4000, but that's gonna be a personal choice. Right now I'm flying on 2200s and it seems to like 2800s. Uh, if you have a little bit of wind, uh, 2800s are just fine, 3000s are just fine. Let's talk about the power on process really quickly here. I have everything set up. This is, there is a flight controller board in here, so when you do power this airplane on, you want to make sure that you plug in the battery while the Osprey is on a completely flat surface. And once it's plugged in, you'll see the, you'll hear the initializing tones, and then you will see the motor pods swing up. And that tells you that the Osprey is ready for flight. So right now everything is level, let's go ahead and take off.
And that is your V22 Vertical Takeoff Osprey. This is available at BananaHobby.com in a couple of color variations. And something really cool is that the landing gears are actually just pressed in. So you can actually just pull them right out and then because you're not going to do any type of, I mean if you choose not to, do any type of uh, rolling takeoffs or rolling landings, you can actually, it would look really scale with the gears off. And uh, just a really fun overall vertical takeoff V22 Osprey, first of its kind with this type of performance. Um, a little bit of wind is okay, definitely size up and battery a little bit if you choose to. Uh, just a super fun airplane. If you want any more information, definitely check this out at bananahobby.com. My name is Pete and we will see you later.